That's my 15-week-old uh, Lycan Shepherd Kurgan. The other one running up there is Lobo. I'm on uh, Pike Island with my uh, better half, Tammy. It's about 7 in the morning, 34 degrees, kind of a brisk day for uh, mid-May. This is the Minnesota River right here. Right across the other side of the river is uh, St. Paul. On the far side of the island is the Mississippi. As I explained in my prior video, Pikes Island is uh, just below the historic part of Fort Smelling, uh, right at the confluence of the uh, Minnesota and Mississippi rivers. After uh, the Dakota Indian Wars, it was used as a prison island. After the Dakota Indian Wars, it was used as a prison island. They kept uh, about 1,600 Native Americans, men, women, and children on the island. And uh, during a pretty harsh winter, uh, three, four hundred of them died of cholera, starvation, and freezing to death. The island's got kind of a unique uh, energy to it. Uh, seen a lot of supernatural stuff down here as a kid. Balls of lights uh, going through the trees. You hear voices and footsteps when nobody's there. Hope you're enjoying this as much as we are. See if I can get it on. It's a bunch of houses that uh, run right along that ridge there. I give my eye teeth to live in one of those. Uh, think of the view these people have uh, every morning throughout the year. Be really nice. Looks like the uh, beavers have been busy cutting down trees. Lots of beaver around the river. Lobo's already flushed up a couple of big turkeys this morning.
A lot of pileated woodpeckers out this morning. They almost sound like a machine gun fire in the distance. Are you guys picking that up? All oh, these Oh, there goes a duck. Must have a nest in the uh, brush there. I'm going to bring the dogs along so they don't mess with the eggs. Kurgan, come on. Kurgan, come on. She probably has uh, some eggs in the... Come on. Yeah, he's right up there, huh? Yeah, it's the one problem when the foliage starts getting dense, it's pretty hard to pick out some of the birds and stuff in the trees. Looks like we're going to have clear blue skies today, huh? Fine. Heck, maybe I ought to pick up some charcoal and let you barbecue. That'd be fine. Yeah. We haven't got the grill going yet this year. Oh, we'll see that squirrel. Not a pretty shot. Thanks. Come here, Lobo. Come here, buddy. Lobo's uh, pretty amped today. Look at that big smile on his face. Oh, it's tangy. That gum, yeah, it's that Sour Patch gum. <laughs> Doesn't taste very good either. It's kind no, of sick. Like Sickly sweet. Yeah, like if you one of those sugar sticks. You're gonna go and do diabetic coma from eating it. Yeah, the river's high, huh? Yeah. Yeah, what kind of bird is that? We had one of those uh, in the tree by our house yesterday. Any of you guys uh, know what kind of bird that is? Put it down below in the comments section. Well, that sun is bright. Pretty shot through there.
All right, now we're approaching the uh, point of Pikes Island here. This is right at the uh, confluence of the uh, Minnesota and Mississippi rivers. My little homie. Wouldn't that be nice to live up in that house and have the view of the river valley? No, I don't think that's going to show up. Now again, this area here is the uh, very tip of Pike Island. It's uh, right at the confluence of the uh, Minnesota River, which runs there. Hey, Damien, there's an eagle over there. See him? And uh, over here is the Mississippi River, and they join right here. Oh, don't get me wet. Some boats on the river. What a beautiful day to be on a boat fishing. Got some geese over there. Yeah, I see that. Now to just give you guys some orientation on where we are. Those uh, Elysian Fields, uh, Elysium Fields videos I uh, shot uh, last week. We were walking right along this ridge line right here. And then uh, some of those videos I shoot on that Wetland Ridge Trail uh, over at uh, the Crosby Farm area are about a mile and through the trails that way on the other side of Crosby Lake. Let's see if we can get some footage of those babies. That's the way we're walking. Again, it doesn't get much better than this, at least in my opinion. I saw a lot of the country when I was in the military and quite a bit of uh, Central and South America and uh, Minnesota is still one of my favorite places to be. They're not happy about us being here. They're squawking. I don't know if it's coming out, but there's uh, two Canadian geese with it, what looks like three babies. Wish these phones had better zooms, huh? Well, this kip's, uh, 
having trouble talking there. This clip's getting kind of long. I'm going to wind it out here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, subscribe down below. Uh, hit the notification button if you really liked it. And uh, thanks for coming along. That's all, folks. Bye.